This is a 60 Q&A practice test. Plaintiff attorney, Mr. Morris, capital M-O-R-R-I-S. Defense attorney, Ms. M.S. period, Allen, capital A-L-L-E-N. We'll start with plaintiff attorney. Ready? Did you deal directly with the people who contracted with you for services? Occasionally I would. Who has the responsibility for profit and loss in your company. That responsibility was mine. With that responsibility, you probably had to do the budgeting, correct? Yes. Was there a senior person above you located in your branch? No. Who did you report to directly? I reported to the president of the company. Did Ms. West advise you when she began employment with your company that she had a lawsuit pending against another company. I'm not sure exactly when I was advised of it, but at some point you were advised of it. You are not sure whether you were advised of it before you hired her. I had several interviews with her both before and after she was hired. I am not sure when it came up. Would you have hired her knowing that she had a prior lawsuit against a company? I am sure that I would have considered the circumstances is that a yes or a no? As I said, I would have to consider the circumstances. Prior to hiring Ms. West and during one of those interviews, did you discuss with her anything about her knowledge of anyone in your company that was not discussed? No. Did Ms. West seem to have a knowledge of what was going on in your company with regard to a lawsuit pending against your company. We didn't discuss that, no. Did Ms. West mention to you, knowing her future husband, 
who was also employed at the company. I am not sure that she knew him at the time. Did you tell Ms. West of other lawsuits against your company at any point in time while she was employed at your company? I don't recall. All right, the word list. Ms. MS period West, capital W E S T. And that is it for the word list. And that will conclude our 60 Q&A practice test.